Hello and welcome to your MESE lesson. I'm Claire. Today, you're going to learn the what, the how, and the when of asking possessive when plus be past questions. Let's start with what. What are these questions used for? When questions are used to ask about time. For example, if you want to ask about one thing, when was your best year? If you want to ask about more than one thing, when were your best years? We use possessive questions to ask about ownership. For example, my vacation or my vacations, your deadline or your deadlines. Good. Now let's learn how. How do you use these questions? First, Know how to conjugate when plus be past. If you want to ask about one thing, please repeat. When was. If you want to ask about two things or more, when were. Let's review the possessive pronouns without the question word. We'll use the noun break as an example. Remember to pronounce the S after plural nouns. Please repeat after me. For one thing, my break. For more than one thing, my breaks. Good, let's continue. Your break. Your breaks. His break. His breaks. Her break. Her breaks. Our break. Our breaks. Their break. Their breaks. It's very important to memorize these conjugations fluently before you start practicing video B. Next, study your vocabulary. For example, when was your internship, your screening, your day off? Finally, to build a more specific question, you can use an adjective. For example, when was your summer vacation? Vacation finished. Tropical vacation. And prepositional phrases. For example, when was your vacation to Europe? In the last few months. From work. So finally, when do we use these questions? You use them to find out more about time. For example, when was your song recorded? When were your parents informed? When was your favorite show on? Excellent! Now, let's review. First, what are possessive when plus be past questions used for? They're used to ask about time or ownership. Second, how do you use these questions? You use them by knowing the conjugation of when plus be past and building a more specific question with the vocabulary. Third, when do you use these questions? You use them to learn more about time. Well done. Let's move on to video B to really practice making your own questions. Remember to keep on reviewing your vocabulary. I'm Claire. And I'll see you back here soon.